Hey everybody. I know sudden change of camera angle. Ooh, freaky. Uh, this video today is about the comment that I read. First off, don't mind the sporadicness. The comment to the video about where my son told this big lie. I confronted him on it. The moment I confronted him about it, I was on the phone. I spoke directly to his mother and his grandmother about why he said what he did. I've, I've asked him several times, Is, did this really happen or are you just making this up because you're trying to get even for some weird stupid reason? So about a good five hours into the into it, because I tore, I literally tore into him for five and a half hours, it seemed like. Because I needed to get to the bottom of it. Because it had gotten to the point where I broke down mentally for the third time. And it's not good for me. And he finally said he made it up. I go, why didn't you say that when I asked you the first time? Instead of saying that it actually happened. And his answer is, I don't know, I don't know. I go, I told you, I don't like people that lie to me. Plain and simple. <laughs> in the story. And it is not, I repeat, not verbalizing or bullying him. Yes, he's autistic. He has moments where I want to reach out and wring his neck, but I don't. As mad as that boy makes me, I try my best to do what I can to make sure he's he is feeling safe and comfortable in my home. Saying that it's bullying, it's verbally verbally bashing him because of what he did apparently you have no idea how screwed up things have been taking things that someone said in a video and they've stated don't pan don't f judge because they're giving advice and seeking advice is completely ridiculous if you have something to say, you can say it to me. Not to the other person making the videos. Not to the other person asking for the advice. You got a problem with what's said? Keep it to yourself or ask me. Because, like I said, I spoke to his mother. I spoke to his grandmother. <clears throat> Now for my second part of the video. Went to my mother's today. I was basically yelled, told to shut up by all three people in the house. And I was literally shoved out the door. For trying to feel and feel, express myself. I was literally told that to leave, shoved out the door, all for trying to express my how I feel. I'm sorry. When did that become a crime? What was that? When did that become so wrong that I can't express myself? Or I can't show how I feel emotionally. Oh, but if I talk, I have to talk low. But everybody else that was around me was able to yell, scream, and do whatever the hell they wanted. Sorry. I'm not doing it no more. I am done. I do everything for everybody else except for, for me. You want to shove me out your door? You want to tell me to shut up until I can calm down? I'm not to come back in the house? Fine, I don't want to be over there anymore. Don't ask me to come over to fix something if it breaks because I'm not going to do it. 
I'm not going to apologize for trying to express myself verbally by getting loud. I'm done. I just can't do it anymore. I can't be this person that does everything for everybody, but yet when I need to help or I'm expressing myself, I'm told to keep it to myself and I, I can't yell. I can't verbally express myself on how, because of me raising my voice. It's stupid. Downright stupid. No, oh, everybody else can yell, scream, punch things, hit things. But yet, I have to find a better way to do it. What's that supposed to do? It just makes it harder for me to express myself because I'm constantly keeping things in when I'm over at my mother's house. So that way it doesn't hurt everybody else's ears. I'm screw it. I'm done. <clears throat> I'm done being nice. I'm I'm done putting up with it. Either talk to me like I'm a person or don't talk to me at all. I'm sorry. I'm just done. Get my sister jumping all over me telling me to shut up. When it's not even her place to say anything to me. Because I have nothing to say to her. Oh, but yet when I'm not in the, I'm not in the room. Oh, everything, everybody's all laughing and everything. Oh, ha, 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 funny. I don't care anymore. I'm going to do what I have to do. And if people don't like it, I don't care. I'm just done. And that's enough for that rant. Third part. I know I've been lacking in my videos. I've just not really been up to it. I haven't been feeling up to it, especially in the last couple days. Um, yeah, I still want suggestions. Give me suggestions. Do you want me to do... a partial costume showing like I did with the claws or do you want to see the full thing? Now, mind you, I got to get the airbrush and paint before I can do that. But I will get it done. <clears throat> I just have to get everything. So, yeah, sorry for the rant and sorry for everything else. I've just been out of it mentally. I mean, I mentally, I can't do it anymore. Mentally, I'm just gone. So, I'll talk to you guys later. Maybe. I don't know. Probably not tomorrow. Maybe Tuesday. I gotta give my brain a little bit of time to unhinge. So, I will talk to you guys probably Tuesday. Alright. Bye.